Hi Days fans, it's Sunday, and we're going to talk about Friday's episode, that's August 21st, and all I can say is, let the genetic testing games begin. Oh yeah. We knew there was going to be a genetic test somewhere along the line. But it was written so perfectly, we thought it was going to be something stupid, like EJ suddenly doubts Nicole, and like how is he going to go about doing that with like totally throwing their marriage on the line. But yeah. this is perfect. He says, you know, maybe I could have saved Grace. I don't want this to happen again. You know, this baby was born in that messed up clinic. I'm going to find out. Yeah, but, you know, Nicole's got a lot of ways to, with a lot of this since that baby does share some genetic information with the father. So oh, yeah. That's just, I mean, they got to use that card because it's, it's just too beautiful not to play. So, speaking of hospitals, Rafe is on. Well, first, He's, real quick, we are certain that they're going to pull out that little piece of uh, DNA. Uh, from Mia? From Mia, mm. from when she cut herself at the, um, we're certain that Dr. Baker saved some of her blood when she cut herself down at the pier. Yeah, so Nicole is going to tell Dr. Baker, uh, you better get that sample out and make it look like that's my blood and they're going to test Sydney and it's going to match up perfectly with that sample. And Dr. Baker's going to be like, yeah, no problem, show me the money. Yeah, uh, give me another uh, half a million or what did she ask? He asked for 100000 the first time. But Stefano is not going to go for that. Oh, no, no, that's the end of that. <laughs> Now listen here, people. This Stephanie Melanie Phillips stuff is juicing up, and a lot of you think that Melanie's going to wind up preggers. That'd be awesome. We need a good pregnancy scare. Yeah, we haven't had a good teen. Well, Mia was pregnant, but she came on the show already pregnant because we needed a baby to adapt. Yeah. But we haven't had a good teen pregnancy since uh, Sammy a million trillion years ago. Yeah. And that was like, I mean, when they decided to make Sammy pregnant at like 16, they pretty much floored me. <laughs> yeah, I'm surprised we that really they wrote that in. That. But uh, Stephanie's, oh, I think we could try to work things out, but I'm going to need to know first what happened with you and Melanie, yeah. which is what I call none of your business. Did you ever see Friends? We were on a break. Well, it is part of her business, but she should accept it. Yeah, it does. You know what? It's all fair and love and war. When you get the ring back, you don't get to ask all these questions. But I think it's more embarrassing for Philip, not that he slept with Melanie, but that he, like, professed this undying love for her oh, and yeah. adoration. And it's like the second Stephanie shows back up on the scene, it's uh, oh, sorry, you know, we have a shot. See you later. Yeah, try, try not what to be too loud. Scumbag. We don't want you to just... Oh, there's that kitty trying to get in. <laughs> Good Lord, you'd think we had a free of Wooly Mammoth at the door. All right, baby, got to go let the cat in. Okay. All right, so, first of all, Stephanie, I mean, she annoys the crap out of me. Does she have hair extensions now? All of a sudden her hair's long again. But Melanie is playing it way cool. She's not going to... Um, I guess she's not going to rat out Philip. No, but... She does tell him that they spent the night together, but when he says, yeah, we talk, she doesn't uh, say exactly what happened. Philip's going to make his days on grave. To hold that secret, Yeah, it's well, not healthy. He doesn't have to hold the secret anymore because that seedy hotel operator... Made oh, yeah, they take tea. the whole... That's right. So how long is it going to take before that surfaces? That's awesome. But Brady or somebody is going to come in and defend her honor because she's already been a victim of this kind of predator before with her father, and they're not going to let that sex tape get out on the Internet and, and make a mockery of her again. No. So maybe he'll come, maybe um, Philip will be your hero, or some somebody's going to help her out. He's not too messed up on the coke that he's going to get from <laughs> Ari. Yeah, that ought to be rich. <laughs> so, um... Rafe is some FBI dude. I mean, oh, yeah. boom, breaks into the uh, clinic, uh, m makes this incredible meeting with a nurse. Ten minutes later, he's cracked the case. I mean, and kisses her right awesome, in the mouth. Dude. What's your name, Sarah? Ma. That was smooth move. Yeah. So he. So what does he know? He knows that 
Nicole had the baby the same night, and he knows that the nurse wasn't in the room, and she was the only nurse on duty. So who was in the room for Nicole's birth? Um, nobody because she didn't give birth. And something about EJ. Why is the fact that EJ... Oh, oh, because um, the nurse recognized EJ, but not with Sammy, or not with Nicole, but with Sammy. Oh. Like... He somehow was lurking about the night Sammy had her baby or something. Remember, I don't she, so. she EJ recognized... was away on vacation. But not she... on vacation, on some business trip. She recognized... The nurse recognized EJ's picture and said, Does he have a British accent? And he's like, Yeah. And then she said, No, I have never saw him with that woman. But then she happened to see the picture in his wallet of Sammy or something, and she said, oh, I'd never forget that smile. Mm -hmm. So when did they see each other? They didn't. Did I he... just, I think, does Rafe know that Sammy had her baby? I can't remember the chain of events. I'm not really sure what his big revelation is. I have to think about this. We're going to have to think about this, people. Maybe you'll fill in some blanks. Just the fact that he had, she had her baby there is pretty amazing, but it's, isn't it... Common knowledge that Dr. Baker was her obstetrician. Mm -hmm. Anyway, he's getting close. And he's yeah. gonna make the. the but the, I want to know how that nurse saw him, saw EJ there with Sammy. I don't think. That's what it seems like, but I don't think that's what happened. But unless when she was thinking about having the abortion, but that was Lucas that was there for that. Yeah. All right. So, what else? The kidnappers. Oh, they're panicking big time. Wow, Bowen kind of psycho. What movie did you Ransom. compare it to? Wow. Mel Gibson. Yeah, so Brenda's the accomplice that starts to flip out. <laughs> yeah. She wants to leave town, but Dean's like, you're, you're not going anywhere, baby. But Bo, or, um, Hope is not too happy about their strategy. No. And she's going to fall into Justin's arms. Yes, I do Yuck. hope they don't go there. But Justin, sometimes is not right with Justin. I hope he's not involved in this kidnapping in some way. I don't think he is. That would make me angry. That would be kind of weird. They brought Justin in to defend Daniel, yet he's involved in the kidnapping. I don't see no. that happening. I don't know. But I do see uh, a Hope and Justin um, tryst. Mm. They need to be broken up, those two. At least for a while. Oh, and Theo. Theo has seen Sierra. Oh, the... Uh, the autism child saves the day. Yeah, this is going to be the way it goes down. <laughs> well, because, you know, autism is a um, disorder of your ability to communicate and relate to other people, but you're still able to see a freaking kidnapper and figure it out, you know. Well, he did. He saw the kidnapper and he noticed they had a tattoo. Yeah, he remembered the That's angel. The clue. Yeah. So somehow they're going to have to figure out that this angel he's talking about is an angel tattoo. So maybe he's going to see the guy out and about. He's going to go, angel, angel. Or maybe they'll show him, like, mug shots and he'll recognize the mm -hmm. angel tattoo mm -hmm. or something. Go Theo. So. How do you think Stefano's going to fix this little genetic testing problem? He's going to suggest to, um, that to uh, EJ, oh, you need genetic testing, I will fly someone in. Oh, and you'll have it all fixed. Yeah. And EJ will never suspect. Yeah. I, I they do not even need that freaking DNA from me. Yeah, I hope they do. That's kind of cool. And I remember a big, they made a big deal about scratching her skin on the fence and going to the doctor. Yeah. I mean, that had no point in no. anything other than for future reference. Yeah. It's like writing a letter. Just in oh, case God. we need to reveal a secret, we're going to write a letter. Yeah. And that letter's still floating around if, uh... Dr. Baker. Dr. Baker he he brought it off. up the other day. So, he's in big trouble. Are you what listening are... to the cat? Yeah, I'm afraid our cat is like... There's a tiger at our door. We're gonna, like... We're gonna wear a hole through the door soon. And make his own little kitty door. I tried to invite her in, but she refused. Is it Scarlet? Yes. Oh, I thought it was your cat. You, you think of him as my cat, not we, our cat? We have... His, mine, and ours. But you know what? Do you consider Burlington ours? Because I still kind of think of Burlington as yours, too. Really? Hmm. Yeah. 